<laughs> oh, who is that? Ruby, knock knock. Your roommate? Why is she knocking so frantically? Saturday nights are our evenings. Come on, you know this by now. Uh, uh, maybe you should get the door. I'm getting impatient, Rumi. Please, open the door. Please get the door. Rumi, open the door now. Hi! Hi! Oh my god. Am I interrupting something? Who is she? I'm a work friend, and you are? I'm his roommate. I can see that. Listen, sorry if you're iffy about guests. We were on our way out. Really? That's funny because Saturday evenings are for me. I let my guard down for three minutes and I'm being replaced. Cute. I don't mean to put a wedge between you two. Are you like... a thing? Yes. What? No. Well, we do things. On Saturday evenings. Which happens to be right now. I'm very aware. I actually insisted Saturday night movie tickets. It was the only night that worked with my schedule. He said he was busy, but I insisted. I guess I'm kind of pushy like that. <laughs> hmm. Well, I suggest you leave before I get pushy, too. Leave? We have a date tonight. And as I recall, you're just his roommate. Just his roommate? Just his roommate. I am a lot more than just a roommate. And do you even know this man? He's crazy. Crazy? I like crazy. Oh, but this one's really crazy. Yeah, he's into some dark stuff. Mmm, I get that vibe from him. No, I mean, he's actually crazy. He's obsessed. Him? Obsessed? Sounds to me like you're the one who's obsessed. You have no idea. Listen. I'd love to chat about how obsessive your roommate is. But we have a movie to get to. No. <laughs> you don't. What are you talking about? <laughs> what are you doing? What's so funny? You had a movie to catch. But looks like your tickets just got refunded. What? What are you talking about? Can she do that? I don't know if my roomies told you, but we're fairly close. I have access to everything of his. Which is why I'm kicking myself for not seeing this coming. I've let my guard down, thinking I had no reason to keep tabs anymore. Because he was all mine. Where did you say you met again? Work. I met him at work. Work. I'm not the following around type, so... You got me there. I'm more of a researcher. Calendars, journals, messages, you name it. I should have seen this coming. Listen, I get the sense that you like being in control. Well, not tonight. Now leave us be. Baby girl, you don't know me. Older girl, I don't have to. I've dealt with your type. Please, you don't know a thing about me. Oh, but I do. <laughs> Obsessed, stalkerish roommate. Crazy in love. I was once you, but I've grown. At some point, you just have to relinquish control. Go the organic route. Strangers, friends, dating. Get to know them patiently. Like I did. Like you did. Exactly. I saw him at work. <laughs> Introduced myself. Knew nothing about him. That's key. Bought him some super nice cologne. That was you? Yes, that was me. God, I... And so over the next couple of weeks, I got to know him. Slowly, 
and purely. Rumi, is this true? Sure, we weren't exclusive, but I thought we had something special. Relax. Just because he's dating me doesn't mean that what you guys have isn't special. If you say that, but- No, I'm serious. If I learned anything from navigating flings and non-commitment situations, it's that you can't take things personally. And I know you're the possessive type. I know because I once was, and I know the insecurity that comes with that. But you've got to understand, he's free to explore, and him exploring has nothing to do with you. You don't get it. We had a bond. He understood me despite knowing everything. I'm never going to find that again, so he's all I've got. See that kind of thinking? That no one else will care for you. That's something you need to work on. I can think of plenty of guys from my past who were accepting of my tendencies. You just have to look. But I don't want anyone else. I want him. Then have him. Don't let me stop you. He can have us both. Us both? You heard me. Look, can I be honest with you? I mean, do I have a choice? I'm sick of this whole women clawing over men thing. We have to stick together. There's no point in fighting over him. Clearly he wants us both. I'm open to sharing him, if it means keeping him. And I'm sure you want to keep him too, right? He's special. I mean, yeah. He is. So do this. For him. Look, I see myself in you. I know you're not a bad person. And I accept you. He accepts you. So why can't we do this together? I mean, I've never done that before. It's new, I get it. But I'm not going anywhere. I'm just as crazy as you are. <laughs> <laughs> then you must be pretty crazy. <laughs> oh yeah, for sure. Rumi. Do you like her? <sighs> I never wanted to share you for the record. There's a first for everything. Um... Okay, I'll let you guys have your alone time then. No, join us. It'll be fun, three of us together. Our movie's canceled, so we can just crash here. I'm the reason your movie got canceled, are you sure? I'm positive, okay? I can share him. <sighs> okay. Scoot over, Rumi. Make some room for me. <laughs> um, what's wrong? Nothing, it's just. Seeing you kiss him like that is... It's weird. <laughs> it's a couple of kisses. We're sharing him, right? I don't know. I don't like the way he looks at you. How does he look at me? Like he's in love. <laughs> We've only known each other for a couple of weeks. He's not in love. Well, he clearly likes you a lot. And he likes you too, don't you? See? Give him a kiss. <sighs> I feel like I'm bound to be replaced. And letting you kiss him like that? I'm digging my own grave. Oh, but you're not. 
were each unique and bring something special to him. You're not losing him. You're just sharing him. Rumi, is this true? Do you still like me? <laughs> Do you still find me intriguing? See? He still likes you. Now give him a kiss. Mm. Mm, I've missed you. Mm.